Hello. Uh, I want to say something clever, but I i don't have that. So what I'm going to say is that um, I've decided that making terrible videos, I mean lesser quality, lower grade videos, is better than making no video at all. So that's what I'm going to start doing. So uh, let's uh, talk about what I'm doing tomorrow. Here we have one. 1987 Toyota MR2. Mr. Dose. Ready to go to Rally Cross in the Kansas region. Tomorrow is an Enduro Cross. What's an Enduro Cross, you may ask? Good question. I don't know. We're going to find out tomorrow. Uh, we're going to run more than one lap at a time, is the idea. So we'll run three laps and then before you actually get a time. So um, it's going to be about preserving the car and not hitting cones mostly so um you know we'll see what happens hopefully the car will stay lit uh st keep keep her moving um let's talk about preparation i haven't done any at all i've got the alpha euro cross on the front this one appears to be mostly flat may also have coolant in it no that's cleaner from the car wash um, uh, the radials, alpha radials on the rear with the big knobs. It's not going to be muddy tomorrow, but, um, I kind of chewed up my other alpha Eurocross running in gravel. So, uh, this is what we got. And then, uh, up here is the old tractor air dirt separator, which I still have not cleaned. I'm going to do that tonight and clean out the air filter and then, uh, should be good to go for tomorrow. Uh, blew that all out. Still dirty, but one more event, maybe. I'm going ahead and button this up. Okay, one more down here. Latch tight. Doesn't look like there's any holes going on at the moment. Clean this all up. No. Not gonna worry about the tubes in between. It's just as long as this one's fine. And uh, oh, that's uh, about all I'm gonna do for preparations. Morning comes cheap white trash. I've arrived with Mr. Dose here in Carbondale for the Enduro Cross. Huzzah! I set up camera stuff and. Uh, you know, make the car go, drive and stuff. Wait up, walk it again, Now I'll walk it with you. So we're, we're gonna go all the way out and around. There's a pin turn in the middle, come up through here, and then, you know, your first two, you just keep going. And we're gonna do three total. So it's gonna be long ass runs. And then on the uh, last run, Rip through the finish over there. Yeah. Man, this site's so awesome. Like yeah. Looking at how much room you still have over there. First enduro cross ever. Woo! That I know of in rallycross. They uh, do it in Salina for autocross um, once a year as a special event. And whether this becomes like a thing we do more than once, we'll find out today. So you are all the test bunch. Congratulations. <laughs> Hooray! So my job, which I'm not supposed to be filming for, is to show people this green sign and the number of laps they have done so that they keep going. So right now, we're going to give him a two. Two. Keep going. Keep going. Yep. Yep. So now he's done two. And I'm gonna flip this. And now he knows that he stops. And I will wave him in. You're done. Third, 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 third. Go. Yeah, that's what I'm doing over and over again. Just pointing. Okay. Out for a parade lap. We're gonna see how good these knobbers do. I really need to dump some air 
pressure. I've got way too much air pressure in these tires already. Uh, I put 35 in this morning just to make sure they wouldn't bleed down. It's gonna be fun. Gotta remember to go around three times. I don't know how much I'm gonna be in second, if I'm honest. Maybe more than I think. It's a good slidey. I'm gonna try this. at it because you know we're supposed to take three laps boy it's gonna get hot in here over the course of three laps I gotta remember to not do that I don't know maybe all the air pressure I got will help me out I want to not rip the knobs off of the mud tires that I have on in the rear it's a very dry day I went for the mud tires in the rear because I had them so you know it is what it is She's going in that way. I went right that, that time. I'm gonna go left this time. Yeah, I don't like that. I like going right better. It takes too much to rotate the car around the cones going to the left. So it'll probably come in hot and it'll want to rotate early, but I think I'd rather go right and, uh, um, you know, drive it more like a front wheel drive car. I'm gonna get out and check some pressures and then we'll be uh, ready to rip for this next lap. Here comes Ryan. 100.1. 100.1 good time. Ryan got a good time at 100.1 for his first triple lap out. Get any 
worse. I've got a lot of pressure in the rears. I got 35 in the rears, um, and it's still kind of a bear to rotate around the tight stuff. Dust collector's already doing its job. Got some crap in there already. A uh, bit of a situation has arisen. It appears that the cluster has stopped working on several fronts. We got nothing for oil pressure, uh, water temperature, or voltage, but the car is running and not overheating as of yet, so, you know. I guess I'll just keep sending it. Maybe it blows up. Who knows? start second heat runs and I've won victory number one the car has started that's good victory number two uh, the gauges seem to be working so hooray time to go to grid who doesn't love a parade who who doesn't want to win the ribbon working this course before driving it I got a pretty good look at this first corner here the big 180 uh, at the end of the lap. I wanna stay close on that corner right there, stay close to the cone. And then we've got the pin turn here in the middle. Give it a scanty. Whip it out of there. I think I'm gonna like driving that one better th uh, this, this way in the afternoon than this morning. Figure I'll go catch some video of Ryan here out on his first run. Where is he? There he is. I think he's really going to send it on this one. It's going to look really good. him two seconds closer. I believe that uh, um, <laughs> I believe that uh, Bill and I were just three seconds off. Bill was real close to him. Uh, he, he was uh, right on top and I was just three seconds off. So we'll see what happens. I hit at least 
this one. What what's the time? 102? Okay. Okay, last run I had a 102 plus one cone. So that's a 104. Ryan ran a 104 plus one cone. Bill ran a 104, no cones. Which is insane for a geo tracker. <laughs> uh, not hit any cones out there, but he didn't do it. We'll see what Ryan gets this time. I believe he's probably on his second lap right now. Uh, that's all the dust you see in the background there behind it, the, the Batipka's rally car. There goes Ryan, right there. He's got 103. 130. Hopefully he didn't hit me. I didn't hear any calls. <sighs> It's just a fight. It's like a prize fight. Did Old you car. Your hood? Um, yeah, before I did that run. Arrow. It's still there. Active arrow. run fast run I'm just gonna be clean that's what I'm gonna do clean and, and smooth clean and smooth try to make less of a workout out of it enjoy the drive ah uh, Eric might break a hundred too no he's not gonna real close though 100.7 uh oh cone You want me to go? All right. Here we go.
things. Then I hit a person, what happened? Wow, 98. I don't care if I hit a cone or not. That was just plain fast. Felt so good. Back her on up here. Slam her on home. Poopity poopity. Lift your truck butt up in the air. Park her up, yeah! Hell yeah, Mr. Two. Mr. Dose, Mr. Dose. I mean, come on. 90 freaking eight. That was awesome. So freaking awesome. He's not even hot. He didn't care. This car is awesome. You gotta go up and see how everybody else is doing. Check the results. Here comes Bill. I didn't catch him in time, but he ran a 102. Ryan's loading up up there. I'm sure he's got some cleanup stuff to do. Strapping down Mr. Dose. And uh, take him home and celebrate his victory. I can't even tell you how amazed I am that we came up first place in modified rear wheel drive. And got the fastest raw time of the day with a 98 second run. With these damn mud tires on the back. <laughs> these tires I was so worried about all day. So, good day. I'm going to finish strapping him down. I'm going to head out of here and uh, spend the evening relaxing because this was a taxing event, Enduro Cross. You know, convince your local SCCA regions that they should give this a shot, but I would go for two laps and not three laps. Three laps is a lot. Two laps is enough, I think. But three laps, you know, at the end of the day, the secret was... I uh, Secret. It's not secret. I just convinced myself that... Um, that... Uh, you know, take it easy, like like the song says, you know, good old Jackson Brown. Anyway, that's what I did. I just took it easy, and I went much, much faster. So, um, yeah, good day out here in Carbondale, Kansas with Kansas Region SCCA. Mr. Dose, victorious. Ryan, second place in the MGB GTS. And I believe that Richard took third in stock rear-wheel drive, so Team OIO representing out here in Carbondale today. So, uh, yeah, but a very good day, and uh, that's all for this time. Bye-bye.